Hey guys, Mark Hall here from Casting Crowns, and today, actually for the next three days, we're going to talk about friendship. Really cool verse in Matthew chapter 5 uh, that I have overlooked a little bit in, in my past that really hit me one day in a quiet time is Matthew 5, 23. Check out what it says. It says, so if you are offering your gift at the altar and remember there that your brother has something against you, leave your gift there before the altar. First, go be reconciled to your brother and then come off your gift. Did you catch that? If you're at the altar, uh, and this, this was before uh, this was before Acts, right? So this is this is back when the sacrificial system was. People, people had to offer animals to sort of atone for their sins, right? Uh, but even then, it was sort of an act of worship. How many times in the Bible do you ever hear God say, "Stop worship"? That's a pretty big deal. He said, "If you're in the mi middle of a worship moment and you've got a problem in a friendship, you need to stop." Why do you think He says that? Well, I can tell you for me, I know why. Because if I've got a problem with a friend, that's all I'm thinking about. Nothing else is on my mind. Uh, I'm sitting up at night thinking about it. I'm having arguments with people that aren't there. Uh, I'm, I'm arguing, having fights with my ceiling fan. And then when I see them in church, I'm trying to act like everything's fine, but it's not. And man, my hands are in the air and I'm just singing all the songs. And out of the corner of my eye, there they are. And you're like, oh, look at them over there, acting like they're all holy. I know, I'm gonna tell everybody. And then here we are, faking what's supposed to be real. And I think Jesus knows that. He's all about relationships, right? So what he's telling us is your friendships matter. If we can't love each other, we can't point anybody to him, yeah? So what we're gonna talk about in the next few days is just uh, how do we deal with friendship? How do you fix friendship? How do we fail at friendship? Uh, one little nugget for the day will be fun. Uh, I think what gets us by right now, when we wanna say something mean to somebody, all you gotta do at the end is say, just kidding. That's all you got to say. It's amazing. You have the face of a goat. Just kidding, right? And if you're texting, you don't even have to say that. Just go, smiley. You can say as venomous a thing you want. As long as there's a smiley at the end, you're off the hook. Check out this verse from Proverbs 26, 19. It says, like a madman shooting firebrands or deadly arrows, so is the man that deceives his brother and says, I was just kidding. Relationships matter. Our words matter. And for the next two days, we're going to look at friendship. Go check out uh, Matthew chapter 5, and let's start praying for our friendships.